a big moment. Switch, good to makes the mark. Oh, let it go, you play with it. Don't do that for me, Shannon. Wait for it there, Dean. So Adam Goods, you would think the distance beyond him here allowed to vacant square goes for Hall. And Hall gets away. And he makes good contact in terms of distance. And he's got the accuracy. It's a goal to the Swans. Getting it off to uh, Carr. Cleverly working it to Brogan. Athletic big man, as you'd expect, from an NBL finalist in basketball. Now Stevens. Stevens and Williams opposed to each other, and that's a magnificent delivery with the left foot. The mark paid to lay. And the veteran lay delivers with a perfect kick. He's a probing left foot kick. Davis and Nix. Nix still a chance. He's a serious chance now. Davis doesn't miss, won't miss, and the Swans get their second. Score not the sight they'd like to see because the Swans have made a very bright start and out of the middle. Goods better watch out. Byron was coming. He did well to affect the tackle. Swans keep it alive. Roberts Thompson kicks another one. A stunning start. That's three. Corns. Peter Burgoyne, Corns again. Shawbel has it covered again. Treadrow takes it off him. Due now, dangerous from there. Stevens, Port had their second. So, how will they go? Oh, it's going to be against him. Brendan Lade taking his chances in this Port Adelaide team with both hands and gets their third. Not sure what he's going to do now. Holding, free Th kick. Get up, Phil. Against you, Stewie. No. There's no need for you to grab him. No need for you to grab him. No. Well, it's going to cost them a goal probably here. Only Twout from the Swans goal. Preswell's having a shot. And it's going to cost them. And cost them dearly as Creswell converts. And the Swans lead by seven again. Thompson. Brogan didn't really have the support he needed there. Bolton always good in that situation. Bit of hesitation, but none from Maxfield. Stuart Maxfield, the captain. The team needs another goal. Oh, and the God. skipper provides. Well done, Crouch. Just a hand in on it from Roberts Thompson. Sydney building again. Uncertainty from the youngster. Big bad Buxley was led. Surely. Had to be tripped. No free kick. Wanganeen. Here comes Bazar again. 40 out. Not a bad effort. He's done it. The Swans lead by 20. Treadray for the time being. Now Kirk. And Sydney setting this up comfortably to Creswell. Great Here's kick. Hall again. Too easy. Wakeman a very tough time. Naked three. And the Swans lead by 25. Thompson. Peter Berger on that. A car. Oh. Didn't know Nix was coming. Sydney's ball. Crouch on the break. Davis keeps it alive for Crouch. We've got numbers. Has two moving for him now. Nixon Williams loves these. Does the veteran from 45? It's another. Still the ball is alive. Bishop going for the boundary. Another chance. Bolton. I see it, but I don't believe it. Another goal to the Swans. Paul calling for it long, but as is the Swans want. Kirk will look for a little short pass inside 50. Ten marks in a row for the Swans. Again, 
It's too far out for Kirk to consider having a shot, you would think. Hall makes his lead now into the pocket. Still scoring for it. Here it is. Well, they're falling off their opponents. Straight. It's been a hallmark of their season. If you pardon the pun. Oh, my God. <laughs> and you summed it up, Steve. It's extraordinary. A very quiet home crowd have watched Sydney kick six unanswered goals in the second quarter. Port Adelaide have fallen apart. Back to Stevens, giving them something in midfield. Oh, well done. Great effort by Barry and Wanganee. Copped him in full flight. Canelli to Stevens. Ablett and Nix. Now Canelli again. Now Craig Bolton. Swans on the rebound. What and Creswell has a hit. Well, Wanganeen on screen. The effort by Leo Barry, sensational. Going back with the flight of the ball, both courageous. Well, Byron Pickett can give them a chance here. Schofield swinging past. Kicks well, lay. Big body in front. From Ford, here's the first. Extra numbers, so he delayed the kick for Creswell. Balls surrounded by Port players back in the square. Adjusted the kick beautifully. Great kick. And Hall takes the mark. And we're Port come out hard in this quarter. But Barry Hall has made a statement. Hardwick again. Now pick it. If it'll sit. Turf a little soft here. A lot of them have fallen over today. Trent Ray hasn't had a big day yet. Was Nix in his back? He was. Huge kick. They're 34 points down. He cuts it to 28. Stop that. Another goal so important for Port. Oh, out of goods again. The athleticism. Brilliant stuff. Crouch, Williams and Hall on the end of it again. Hard to stop. Give That's probably the best of them all. From Barry Hall. Jumper in the grasp. Jumper. Steady foot through it there, and he's done the job. He's got four, and he keeps them in touch. Roberts Thompson serving him well. Now Williams on the breakaway. Hall has had to come a long way up ground, but has Maxfield running for him. Umpire lost it his way. Here's Goods. An open goal in front of him. If it will sit, it's gone through. Williams has kicked a monster. They've got to be quick. They've got to be good. Someone's got to snare it. Trent Ray is that man. No, he's not. Chad Corsi's. By the letter of the law, it didn't look like it was. The brothers' corns. Put Port Adelaide back in it. Sits it up, hoping for Tread Ray. Half volley. Sean Burgoyne trying to do something. Tread Ray. Well done to Peter Burgoyne. You can mark this down. Four possessions. He, Carr, and Lay, perhaps the three best for Port. Here's Brogan. Trent Ray's coming. And he arrives in time. Montgomery, it's a tough corner to kick a goal. He decides it's too tough. Lay! Five out. Played on from a black range to miss. His brother marks it. Had a nightmare of a day. 
And he's not confident enough to have a shot. Gets the result he was after. There's still a chance. It's a goal. There's still a chance for Port Adelaide. And Mark Williams to redeem themselves. The players are in the forward half. They're almost all in the 50. Yeah, almost certainly the forward third of the ground. So can Port Adelaide find a path through there? Left in the tank, Good smother. but he got a smother in. Fosdai just blasts away. Nothing to kick to. Tailed it for the boundary line. Made it tough for Kingsley. Hit him in against the line. Siren! Oh, one of the all-time unbelievable finals wins. The Sydney Swans have confounded the critics again. And what can you say about? It's going to be a very dark night of the soul for Mark Williams. 15-10-100 Sydney. 13-10-88 Port Adelaide. Words just can't describe that effort today. Can't. That has to go down as one of the Swans' all-time great wins. Travel from Sydney to Adelaide. No one expected them to take this game off. But what a performance. What a performance from the Sydney Swans. They outplayed Port all day. Port players on screen or down on the ground at the moment are dejected, hands on hips. They know that they've let go a huge opportunity. Let's get down to